Well, hello, my YouTube family everywhere. Once again, this is Jason, Fitness Captain Music. That's right, guys. This is my professional photographer. I'll have him and his name in the description, as you can see by his image. I hope you guys like my new YouTube shirt. And my fellow fans everywhere and friends on YouTube, thank you guys for coming on over. You know, as I keep saying, I really am truly overwhelmed by the amazing positive response. I'm humbled, I'm honored, and I want to extend, in other words, my deep appreciation, guys. My heart is filled with gratitude for all of you that have subscribed, those of you that have given me the thumbs up, and all your comments. As I said before, I've been inundated with so many great comments and recommendations, and I read them, guys, and I appreciate your engagement. So people new to my channel, I hope you guys will subscribe as well if you enjoy my videos. Give me the thumbs up, it helps with the algorithms. And again, feel free to leave a comment everybody. Now today, Jason Fitness Captain Music, he wants to show you another amazing performance on America's Got Talent, The Champions, by none other than the incomparable, the super talented, and he's really a sweet, lovely dude. It's Marcelito Palme. That's right, guys. We're going to get into it, and it's the final performance. Beauty and the Beast is the song. I'm sure a lot of you are probably familiar with that song. It's sort of a, a Disney-esque feel to this song, isn't it? Well, we'll see how he does. Every performance so far in America's Got Talent, guys, he has been supreme. He's just had stellar performances. His pitch has been on point. It's just remarkable, guys. This is live that, he's, you know, that he did these performances in. Doing it with his dual voice, of course, switching his larynx position to sing the female and the male side of the voice. Just unbelievable. You know, I'm amazed that so many people are, guys. And he's such a humble and, and very generous man, it seems, by all accounts. Um, you know, and I want to say, guys, for all you Filipino people out there and fans, I've known a lot of Filipino people over the years. I'm friends with some. Very thankful. You people are known for your humility, generosity, and passion, and you're hardworking too. So I commend you guys, and all my Asian fans out there, you guys seem to have extra passion on a lot of you out there, and you're great people. And people around the world, you know, welcome guys. So let's get into it, shall we? Without further ado, let's dive in, and maybe we'll give some analysis along the way. We'll certainly uh, have you guys listen, hopefully, with me, and I hope you enjoy. Let's see how well Marcelito performs. Can he do it again? Can he pull it off, guys? Well, let's find out. I, I'm anxious to see what he's going to do with this song. And will he win, guys? We'll get into that at the end of the video. Ooh. Right away, beautiful head voice, right? Heidi Klum's excited, the judge. Nice, beautiful. Woo. Nice spectacle, beautiful stage, and what a voice. Sweet. Whoa! There's that transition, guys. Woo! Excuse me, guys. I wanted to pause it there. You notice he's going from his countertenor to sort of the male soprano voice, of course, now. Big time with that deep, rich tone. And he, again, guys, he's able to switch his larynx position, shaping those vowels, and, and transition from the female side to the male side and back down again, right? Just controlled of his mastery of his voice, guys. You know, again, you talk about a master class of dramatic vocal dynamics in the voice, right? He is showcasing. It reminds me of Dimash a little bit that way, except... Marcelito's style is again going from that ultra feminine tone to the ultra male baritone voice. You know, my favorite singer, Dimash, he's got that operatic, amazing technique, and so does Marcelito, guys. And Marcelito's one of my club favorites now, for sure. Thanks for listening, guys. Let's continue. It's beautiful so far. Hope you guys would concur. Here we go. I just got to get it to go. Beauty and the Beast. Beauty and the Beast. Never 
Sing Marcelito. Yes. Beautiful. Power. Yes. Love those belts, those operatic belts. Back to the falsetto, beautiful high voice. What range? Woo. Nice words. Woo. Yes, they're going crazy. Beast. Beast. Whoa. Ho, ho, ho. So high, so effortless for him, seemingly. Still holding the vibrato. Now he's finished. Yeah, I guess you better clap. Might as well give him a bow. Unbelievable. Fantastic. Woo! Scintillating stellar performance again. Two of the judges here. You gotta love Marcelito's like smile. Just, just never you can tell he's such a nice like guy. When those voices are all coming out, and it's like so many voices. But he's fierce on stage. It's just incredible over and over yes. and over again. I agree. I can feel it from the reaction from the audience too. I don't know. I haven't had, I haven't can you feel it? I felt I felt the positive vibe from Marcelito. And you're also very very smart because you always pick songs that we all know and love. Yes. And kind of follow and if you know what it sounds like. I think it was a wise choice this song. Even though it's a very familiar song, but I think it was a smart choice. Oh, Bet Simon will disagree. Saw you, you blew me away because it was the Howie. surprise of it all. Like we don't expect both voices to come out of one person, and I thought, is this a gimmick? And then the second time I saw you, not, I enjoyed it just as much. Yeah. as Not a gimmick. And I feel the same thing about tonight. You're making the right choices on the right song. Yeah. That's right. He's made the right choice. I agree with Howie. No joke there. Marcelita, the song choice was perfect, and I actually. I agree. He's up this game. This was the, even a better performance, guys. I didn't know he could improve even on the other two amazing performances, but I think this was, this tops it all, right? Last one, too. You're right, Simon, on that. Absolutely. Absolutely. If it was my choice, oh. on a night like this, if it was my choice, done what? Something less predictable. Um, give me a <laughs> give me a break. As if Simon's even a singer, he doesn't even sing. Give me a break. But it's his opinion. He's got to add more drama, guys. Right, Simon? Oh please. Oh yeah, right. Given you another moment. Oh, got please. Definitely fact, does. Really do. Absolutely. You better believe he's got a massive career ahead. Right, Woo! Let's hear, Let's hear it for Marcelito, guys. Hi, YouTube. Woo! So please make sure to subscribe. Yeah. You know, like, Gotta shut you. it off, guys. Oh, I can't yeah. shut it off. <laughs> Can I shut it off? There we go. I did it, guys. But wow, what an amazing performance, right? Again, from Marcelito Pomoy. I hope I pronounced his name right. Unfortunately, I didn't have my friend Cooper on this video this time. Couldn't do it. But And hopefully, I'll get my nieces involved one day on these react music reaction videos, guys. And So you got a lot to look forward to. I should say my adorable nieces. That's right. Anyway, have a great day, everybody. Thank you so much for sharing your time with me. Feel free to leave a comment, guys. Is Marcelito going to win this competition? And by the time I air this video, he may have won the competition already. But you guys can let me know. Let's discuss it among ourselves. There's been a lot of great contestants on this show. And in, in, when it comes to singers, of course, you have the amazing Angelina Jordan as well, right? She's now 14 years old. I covered her one, one of her songs, guys. You could check it out. 
But Marcelito Palme, I've covered every one of his songs on America's Got Talent, guys. Feel free to hop on over to my other reactions, okay? Had a lot of views on the song Prayer, his first one. So, again, guys, every performance, he's just been supreme, stellar, so impressive. And, again, my understanding is, as I said in the other video, I think, guys, he's, he's basically trained himself. He hasn't even taken a formal single singing lesson, supposedly. I mean, it's hard to believe, but... Um, and you know what a backstory, right, guys? He was he grew up poor and was trying to find his family. Just an amazing story, and he did find his family. And again, he seems so engaging himself, so positive. And we wish him the best going forward. I'm sure he will have a an amazing, massive career, as as Simon said, and successful career, God willing. And he will be a global sensation. He's already there now, and he's only going to get more popular. And he deserves all the accolades I think that that he can get. And let's hope he stays humble and grounded and uh, continues to perform amazing songs for us. Right, everybody? Thanks so much for listening. And if you enjoy my reactions today, guys, I hope you'll subscribe. I hope you give me the thumbs up. Find that church bell and hit it so you can be notified for my future videos. Now, Jason Fitness, Captain Music, he might have to go work out and maybe even listen to this song again. You never know. Take care, guys. Thanks for listening. Thanks for listening to my reaction. Take care. Bye-bye.